YouTube, what is up? This is TWS Tutorials with another prop. This week, we're making a hidden blade. Hey YouTube, guess what we're making, a hidden blade. First, before we make this, I have a few things to talk to you about. Number one, remember, I'm not responsible for your actions. If you hurt yourself, I'm not responsible, you are. Remember that for all my bones. And also, today, um, I, you might have noticed the title sequence wasn't like the other one that much, but it's the same thing, but uh, what I did is I recorded it on a computer screen because I accidentally deleted my other one. So I'm thinking of making another one, another title sequence. So if you have any requests for my new title sequence, uh, you can just put that in the comments. I don't know which way it is. Somewhere, I think it's down there, but who knows. So. Second thing is, I have been doing a lot of props without you guys knowing. I'm so sorry, I've been making things like chainsaws, uh, security cameras, fake bricks. I'm so sorry, I'll try to make a whole video about some of the things and explain to you how I did it. But, so, check my YouTube channel often and that possibly will be there. Enough chit chat, time to do the blade. So now we'll have to, actually, oh I forgot, I left the envelope somewhere, I forget where it is. I'm just going to tell you how much it's going to be. It's going to be about maximum $5, keep that in mind, $5, okay? So let's get on to the build. Here are the materials and the tools you will need for this build. Pretty simple. Let's do it. Cardboard. Retractable knife. Electrical tape. Scissors. Be careful with them. Uh, Keychain. Uh, side cutters. If you're weak, you might need pliers. And a paper clip. I have a whole box here, but you only need one. A drill. And drill bits. Keep in mind, for me it was $5. To you it might be more because you might need to get a tool, but things you probably have are scissors, you know, tape. By the way, it doesn't have to be electrical tape, it can be duct tape too. So, for me it was $5, it might be a little different for you. Keep that in mind. On with the build! So first, take your cardboard and cut it to fit around your wrist. That's probably good for me. Remember to measure to make sure it fits pretty snug. Mine didn't go all the way around, but yours should. Next, you're gonna take your retractable knife and you're going to tape it on. Then it should look like this. And make sure to put, um, uh, some tape right there so it can stay on when you put it on. So this is what it looks like so far. And so far, this is kind of your basic sheath. But, um, we're going to do modified a little bit more. 
so now you're going to want to take your side cutters. Be very careful with these. Uh, don't get your finger jammed in there or anything. And take your keychain and just cut it. Like, be very care. Be sure to wear eye protection while doing this. <sighs> if side cutters won't do the job, use pruners. Uh, I had a really hard time with side cutters, so I used pruners instead, and I got it off. So you really only need the K ring, so it can go on your finger like this. This is going to be part of your latching thing. So be sure to keep this. This is what you want to snip off at the end. This is all you need. So pruners, be, remember, be very careful with these two and wear eye protection while cutting. Next, you're going to want to take your pliers. You're going to want to undo your paper clip. Make sure you attach it onto your key ring. Like so. So I'll get back to you when I've done that. So now I've done that and I've attached my key ring to the paper clip. You don't have to use pliers. I use my hands. But if you don't want to get your hands beat up or anything, I suggest to use pliers to bend it. You could also use gauge wire for this. It doesn't matter. I just had paper clips and you can also use wire too, so but I but these are more common so I used this next take your drill and get the get your drill pack and make sure get the smallest drill bit you have so it's gonna drill so make sure it's about the size of your paper uh, your your uh, paper clip so make sure it's about the same size and next, the next gonna drill right here right up here in the blade and right there on the other side I'm just gonna do that in a moment now we're gonna get away. Okay, see we have another hole in there. Are. So now we have one there, there, and right there. So now you got three holes in here. Okay, so now that you had your uh, thing drilled in, you're gonna want to take your latch thing, put it on your finger, and you don't have to put it on right yet, but I suggest not to. Put it in this side, and you're going to want to take the blade and push it down. Then put the paper clip in right where they meet. For the blade, wait, like this, so it goes through all of them. Wait. So it does this, and it goes through, and it goes through the blade right there. It's attached. Now you're just going to put it to your arm, and put this on your now finger. It's in like that, and it's attached to your finger, and it's gone through. And now you just pull like that, and I, like that, and it just comes out. And there's your hidden blade. Make sure to put a long sleeve shirt on, or a sweater when you're doing this, so you can, so it looks like nothing's going on. And remember, this is a prop. This is for movies only. This is very dull. This is for movies only. Don't be stupid and go in public with this. This is only for movie. This is for movies only. So be extremely careful and have fun using this in your next movie. So there you go. There is your very own, you know, in blade. So now you can use it in your next movie, you know. But remember, be careful, don't take this in the public, and I'm not responsible if you get in trouble or if you get hurt making this, because in here there is actually a spring. So be careful um, if you take it apart or anything, be careful. 
I'm not responsible for it, remember. So, hope you enjoy this, and I will make my next video, which will be about all my props, and I will tell you how I make them. No one actually show you like I did this and my other video, my lightsaber one. I'm not sure when I'm going to make the test videos on um, my other videos, uh, on my lightsaber one and this one. Um, not sure yet, so uh, you're going to have to comment or whatever so to give me some ideas because I have no idea what to do. So please comment, rate, and subscribe to my channel. Uh, thank you so much for viewing my other video. I have over 500 views on my How to Make a Lightsaber. And thank you very much. Remember to leave a thumbs up or thumbs down. I don't know how that works. Um, or comment, rate, or subscribe. Thumbs down, thumbs up. Remember to watch the whole video so it counts as a view. So... Thank you for watching. See you later. Wow.